Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to our Stellaris Let's Play series. We've got quite a fun one for you today. We're going to be uh, going doing quite a lot of uh, spicy, spicy things today. Um, the way this is going to work though is just we're going to carry on straight on from yesterday and it is one recording session so it's going to go straight into the gameplay so I want to give you a, a little bit of a ease into that. So uh, having said that, I hope you all enjoy and uh, let's get into it. See you there. And we are actually going to make a, um, we're going to add a new design, we're going to make it Corvettes, we're going to go for an interceptor, uh, we're going to use two lasers and a coil gun, and we're going to, there we go, and actually which, uh, so lasers are worse against shields. We're going to assume they have shields and increase our um, shields there. So Corvette laser uh, does not have enough power. Okay, that's because we've got too many shields. Oh, we got a reactor boost, so we can do that. Excellent. There we go. They've revoked their um, guarantee of independence as well, so it's fairly likely they will actually declare war on us soon. We're going to continue expanding out here though, and get our science ships moving. And we're going to get them to research this one. This one's also idle. And we're going to send our fleets out here. We're going to use this to do we build an anchorage. We did indeed. Excellent. So we're going to get a few more laser corvettes as well. And we will look at declaring war on them soon. Ah, okay, so we get a strike craft as well because these are fairly useful. Well, very useful actually. Uh, because strike craft will allow us to make hangar bays and they will protect our trade routes on uh, around systems. And we've now found the hostile. Okay, right. If we can wait for that to go through. We've got more unemployment over here. Ridiculous. I built or made jobs for you. I don't want to take them. Could it be more of these? The food will sort itself out when um, our next population here will go over. That's absolutely fine. Uh, the archaeological project. Okay, that's fine. Communications alert. Construction complete. Mm, they want some non-aggression pact with us now. I'm going to decline that for now and wait. And I'll initiate that if we still can't get superior to them. And we're going to see uh, what's happening with this other species over here. And we're going to merge these fleets. So that's 20 out of 20 in there. We can only get four more. Okay. Alright, we're still not getting any luck finding that other empire. Okay, so we've got a uh, slave revolt on uh, Ambor Prime. This is likely due to the lack of amenities here. So that's absolutely fine. What we're going to do is um, create a planetary administration. Hopefully we'll be able to um, unlock our next slot with that. And what we're going to do with that is create uh, amenities building. Okay, so we're going to have a look at this empire now. Where are they? Okay, so it's the north of us. And they're fairly big by the looks of it. Uh, what we're going to do is build a spy network with our available spy here and wait for that again. Okay, so we're getting a similar problem over here where we are lacking in amenities. That's absolutely fine. I'm going to make a decision here. I'm going to increase our amenities for 100 um, things. We're going to make the same decision over here. Getting uh, less stability because of that will expire sometime. That's fine. And we found more um, another empire. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our spy network away from the shrooms, 
and put them to that. And we can now create, so well, we can't quite create anything just yet. We're going to buy some more minerals. Uh, it's 400 minerals we need. Market. Uh, we're going to buy some more. Uh, we're going to build... Do you want a slave processing facility? Could do, could do. Because we sort out our amenities for the moment. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to build some more jobs here. Let me double check over here as well. I want to build some more stuff over here. What do we need? We need hundred. We need more uh, minerals for that. Buy some more. Finery world, and we're going to make some generator districts. Actually, no, we're not. We're going to make some more mineral districts. Because that's what we're severely lacking at the moment. Making all of the uh, greatest, uh, all of the greatest um, decisions here. But we now have a stranded scientist. So we found someone. Yes, uh, we can, she can join us. We're going to see what's happened with that. We now have a new scientist here. Ah, uh, look at that. Spark of genius and computing expertise. So I know exactly. And they're also uh, level six. So we're going to put them into our physics research here. I'm going to carry on down here. But we're going to go down here to get the um, increased stability. Uh, we're going to go back to the market and add a new monthly trade of food. And uh, we're going to make it 10. And that's just source our energy income for now. Where is our minerals going though? They're just going from jobs. Okay. That's absolutely fine. We're going to build some more over here. Oh, I know we have a low stockpile. So we're going to buy some more. We're going to source all this out. It's absolutely fine. We have money. We can do this. <laughs> yep, okay. So we're finding all of the empires now. We're going to be very enclosed over here. Technological acquisition successful. Uh, we're making contact with even more. Uh, we're getting more technology. Uh, no, why are you doing this? Why are you telling me I've done technology? Oh, it's given us technology. Okay, brilliant. So let's double check all of that. We go into our research and we have... Better sensors for black hole observatories and subspace sensors, and a defense grid computer. Eh, it could be better, it could be worse. I'll take that. And we can't really do anything with this because we don't have a spare envoy. Do we? Do we sort of do, but that's okay. I want to get uh, information on this lot, so that's what we're going to do now. Launch that. And that should be done in some time. But also, okay, the dark grid has been alerted to our presence. Okay, we're going to get a diplomatic event here. Spy Master Rabba, Dorsal of Larg, and our colleagues have smoothed over operatives' awkward intrusion with the dark grid. So that's these people over here. It's possible that in private. Okay, okay, so we'll see what happens from this. What are their. Okay, so a machine empire. Brilliant. So that's what we'd like to get through. Maybe we should uh, make some good relations with them. Okay, so we're going to look again at this. Uh, they are overwhelming. So, what should we do here? Tell you what, we are going to make destroyers. Or not make, research them. We're going to wait for our um, blue lasers to upgrade, and then we're going to see if we can declare war on these. Even though they are overwhelming, we should be fine. We can play defensively and wait for them to come to our space station here. Because it's standing at a small strength, but that's okay, we can back this up. Technological acquisition successful. And we'll put a leader in our fleet once we get round to it. just don't want to pay the upkeep for them just yet. Uh, we're going to get increased naval capacity. Not necessarily useful to us at the moment, but that's okay. Just get it so it's in the bank. Rather strange uh, 
noises there. Uh, we're just going to double check on these. We have one job available. That's okay. We're going to put... Uh, we're not going to put stuff there. Okay. We have found a Leviathan somewhere as well. So we're going to keep an eye out for that because we'll be able to use it for quests later. Oh, we have found a cruiser as well from a special project. So we're going to bring that over. We're going to look at its design, if I can remember. There we go. Oh, so it's got plasma launchers and best... Oh, excellent, 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 excellent. Do love me some plasma launchers. That's going to help us greatly in this war. And they're actually inferior now, uh, technological technology wise and they only have a slightly superior so they weren't overwhelming by far just that one cruise has made all the difference so I think we have a good chance of uh, winning this war when it comes around so what we're gonna do is carry on over here with search projects mission completes with this espionage operation so we're gonna double check their strength now unknown still what the ruddy bloody hell I thought I thought it would tell us we'll try again Gather more information. Didn't really work, did it? So, uh, over here, yeah, let's double check what we're doing. We're going to build, I think to solidify our stuff here, we're going to build um, an amenities uh, building just in case because that's only going to um, drag us down. So we need more uh, minerals again. Five, 500 more. It does take a while to get your feet on the ground sometimes, but that's okay. I'm going to build some hollow theatres for that. Yeah, we're going to build some hollow theatres for that. Just thinking about uh, getting money from those commercial zones. Encounter into Zanga, okay. That's fine, that's more aliens. We're finding everyone. After a while, we're going to get the um, galactic community up. Okay, so now we have our better lasers. We're going to install them we find our ships, we're going to do that. Install these better lasers. Save. Yep. Upgrade. Them. It's only a few, but it'll make a difference. We're going to wait for that, core, uh, that cruiser to come around as well, and then we'll declare war. Ship augmentation is completed. So, before we declare war, we're going to put some claims on. So, what do we want? Do we want an extra planet? That would be nice, wouldn't it? Do we have much? We do have some influence to do this. So, we're going to push them back by these two. Because this one has uh, Zero on it. This one does have moats, actually. So, we're going to go for this first. And that's we're gonna go for all of these. So we have the influence to spend on making these claims. So to do that, we're also going to build some armies so we can actually take that um, planet. We should be fine. We're gonna make two real assault armies, and we're gonna make some more slave armies. They shouldn't have too big a defense. There should only be four or five defending armies. If that, because our defending armies aren't really great, so if they don't have any uh, specific military buildings, we should be fine. Let's continue. What I'm worried about more is their fleet power, but it is only a little bit superior, and their um, technology is inferior. We should be okay. Just waiting for this to come around now. So tell you what, what we're going to do is assign a leader. Where are you? We are... Christ, yeah, what do we want? Leader experience, not really. Uh, FTR damage risk, okay, yeah. Ship weapon uh, range, that will do it. So that will do it. That's not so bad. So we can engage them, obviously, from a further distance. I'm also going to source out what the hell is going on with our food and energy. I do not know entirely. Let's see. So it's mostly coming out from our districts and buildings. That's okay. We can handle that. Absolutely fine. <laughs> we have absolutely no problems at all in this game. <laughs> What we need to do really though for that is of course make more um, energy districts, which we can't because we're lacking. That's okay, just wait for that to go around. 
Small obstacles, small obstacles. It's okay. <laughs> Continue with our uh, exploration. Now that we've made our claims, we're going to declare war. We're going to go for our conquer claims. Uh, Cassus Belly. Because we don't necessarily have any other um, available to us. That's okay. We don't want this to be a long war. So what we're going to do is we're going to Blitzkrieg. We're going to go straight up to this one first. And come back down to here, then to there, then to there. And we may fall back to Hark if um, they decide to attack us. So they do have a lot of uh, space stations out. Um, we could have a look over here. We can't see exactly what's going on. But uh, they should have some sort of proper space station over there. So we'll see what happens. We'll keep our cruiser over here for now, and it will join when we attack Schnick. Oh, Schnick. Now then, this is reducing our sublight speed and uh, nullifying shields. So that works both ways. Just a bit concerned about the speed here. See how slow it is, even on max speed. So okay, we just need to take out the uh, station here. It's absolutely fine. It's only a little outpost. Get some more encounters. There you can see. I can grab it. It's not really. You can see our health not really going down at all here. So easy, easy peasy. Excellent. Come straight down here. We're going to. Oh, we can see their fleet actually. Let's see. It is 498 strength. Absolutely fine. We can deal with that even possibly just with our cruiser. Uh, maybe not just with that. It's on 406. But. Uh, very close. So what we're going to do with our cruiser is put it. Where is it? We're going to put it over here, so it can jump easier to Shinnick. Put it on the right one. Yep. Excellent. Let's go. Not going to bother repairing. That's okay. Mission accomplished on our spy. Has it really helped? No. Okay. Great. So, come on. When are these getting over here? Alright, so we're going to jump with this now. And we have a hostile fleet present over here. That's their main fleet. Okay. Okay, that's their main fleet. Can we see exactly what their designs are? No, we can't. No worries, we do outmatch that. So once we get over here and conquer Shinnick, we're possibly going to go back over and encounter it. That's okay. So uh, we're gonna go over back to Farkid here. System survey complete. And we're gonna tell them to jump over and engage. Alert station engaged. That's okay. See, this station now that we captured it is actually ours rather than destroyed. So we'll start fighting them. Won't we'll really do a hell of a lot, but uh, it's uh, a nice distraction while we jump in. They don't have a leader by the looks of it as well. Ooh, okay, so we have found a. Uh, I forgot what they're called now. Looking. Conclave. That's it, Enclave. That's okay. We'll deal with that later. We're distracted at the moment. <laughs> but here we go. We can see. Oh, they do have a leader. That's okay. We're dealing far more damage. Watch the numbers and the health go down there. Look at that. Absolutely ripping them apart. This is their superior fleet as well, apparently. Excellent stuff. So we're going to come back down here because we've got another minor fleet there. And we're going to look at our transport ships. We're going to embark them. We can. No, they're all up. So we're going to bring them over to Harrick just to be ready for our invasion. Should really have looked at the uh, reports there, but that's okay. Found an abandoned gateway. That's not going to tell us where it is again. It's very important as we find this gateway. Very important we find this gateway. Nope. Okay, good one. Uh, so now they are attacking our actual space station. We can't let them take this. Oh no, they're not attacking it. They're coming around. Okay. 
so much for a fast wall. Okay, they're jumping down to us again. But we're not going to let them. Oh, no, they've caught our transport ships. Of course, our transport ships. We can't retreat. Can't retreat. No. Okay, so we've distracted them with our fleet. Hopefully, we should be okay. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. We're going to orbit this. And we're going to repair here. Anomalous surface variable detected. Oh, we have missing. We go. Oh, this is exactly what we want. We want um, droid workers, which will increase the effectiveness of our robot populations. Let them take more jobs. Specifically, administrator jobs, I believe. Where is this? Okay, that's fine. They're building uh, ships like no tomorrow, aren't they? It's their uh, manufacturing power that's greater than ours. So, okay, we've not actually lost any ships at the moment. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back to Shinnick and carry on with our plan. Because they do have a higher war score than us at the moment. And that's because they keep uh, recapturing everything. Oh, I don't want them to go over here. I want them to risk it. Fuck it, it doesn't matter. We found another empire over here. We're getting a lot of uh, machine empires over here, aren't we? Going to retreat our um, armies so they don't get attacked again. Go back over here to Harriet with our fleets now that we've repaired. Uh, we're going to double check what is going on job wise. We're going to increase or upgrade our planetary capital. Search that, and we have some job spare over here. We do want to increase this though. And we were right to move our transport ships away because they're attacking again. They do have a lower count than our space station, and we do have the crews there, so we should be okay. And they've got a secondary one over here, we should be okay with that. Oh, we've just been given that, okay. Oh, I wish it would tell us a bit clearer. How are we doing over here? Lost one ship, finally. That's alright. So we're going to take both of our fleets and send it down here. They're attacking and attacking and attacking. This one's actually a bit dangerous at 1.2. Lost. Now I've lost our um, fleets. This has not gone well, everyone. It's not gone well at all. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to build more laser corvettes on here and we're going to build more missile ones over here. That might mean we've lost. No, we've not lost our leader there. Okay, that's fine. Because we don't haven't actually lost the fleet completely. They've just retreated and abandoned. So we haven't lost a massive loss for us there, but we will need to repair. Now suddenly thinking about uh, white piecing it. <laughs> and going for the status quo. Uh, because we're not going to surrender at all. Come on. Again, so much for Blitzkrieg. System survey complete. And our fleets have returned, so we're going to repair them. Put them in the queue. They've taken our... Oh no, this is terrible. It's terrible. <laughs> They're actually close to winning with their war score. Oh, you can't win all of them, I suppose.
So let's send them over to defend. Should take this rather handily. And rather than uh, do the force of habit and... Oh, uh, they've got destroyers. This is why uh, we're struggling a little bit. It's absolutely fine. Well, it's not fine because uh, it's making things more difficult. But we are going to read the reports after this and see what, what happens. We're going to see if we can look at their designs. Uh, we can't, that's unfortunate. To have the scanners on our ships. So, what actually happened? Their damage to the hull and shields. Okay, so we're, we're damaging their shields fairly well. That's what they're going for. It's the damage to the armor they're doing to us. Which suggests they're using coil guns rather than lasers. Okay, okay. So really we should um, increase our um, laser, our shield efficiency. Still making anything? No, we're not. We're going to regroup at all of our um, our fleets, put them here, and we're going to attack all at once at Hark. More people we're finding. But on the plus side, at least uh, most of our incomes are in the positive. <laughs> We've got a new space over here. So what were you looking for? We might want to go for an energy grid, actually. Yeah, let's go for an energy grid. This is what we need. Um, yeah, we can do that. That's fine. I do like myself an energy grid. Now I'm going to put this one on auto survey. No, can we not? Great. Doesn't like that. So we're going to put this one on assist research. Where are you? It's not going to move. Okay, great. There's no point, is there? Really no point. I think they're stuck in borders. No. Ooh. Excellent. Okay, so they've attacked us over here. Absolutely fine. Destroyed them. They want peace. What sort of peace do they want? They want a status quo. Let's go with that. Let's go with that. I'm happy with that. We haven't actually lost anything. We didn't gain anything. We didn't lose anything. I'll be happy with that at this point. We, we're not going to get any too far with that. That was a bad decision in the end. <laughs> and it's uh, distracted us from um, internal issues. So, on that bombshell, that's going to be the end for today. It's been dragged on again, uh, but we had so much stuff happen with that war again. So, I have been the Edified Gamer, and I hope you've enjoyed this episode. So, uh, I hope all your nights and days will be auspicious in, in the meantime. Goodbye.